Hi Aquarius and welcome. My name is Inez and today I'll be doing your weekly love reading from October 27th through November 2nd. And please keep in mind these, these are general love readings so I cannot or will not resonate with all of you. So if it doesn't apply, then let it fly. <clears throat> Excuse me, if it does apply, then I would love to read your comments down below. And also I want to let you know that I'm still doing the pre-holiday special and the way that works you will help me gain a thousand subscribers and you could win a ch and you'll be able to win a chance to receive a weekly love reading for one month and all you have to do is subscribe to my channel take a screenshot email it to me and include your name and number so i can enter you into the raffle and as far as my current subscribers all you have to do is share my channel with your friends and family and when they subscribe you take a screenshot as well, email it to me with your name and number, and you will get entered into the raffle. Simple as that. Okay? Now let's get your reading started. Now I already shuffled your cards, but I will shuffle them again. Okay, Aquarius. Please tell me about Aquarius in love from October 27th through November 2nd, 2019. Please tell me about Aquarius in love from October 27th to November 2nd, 2019. Please tell me about Aquarius in love from October 27th to the sec November 2nd, 2019. Please tell me about Aquarius in love. Please tell me about Aquarius in Love from October 27th to the 2nd, 2019. Please tell me about Aquarius in Love from October 27th to November 2nd, 2019. Please tell me about Aquarius in love from October 27th through the 2nd, 2019. Okay? At the bottom of the deck, we got the Eight of Pentacles. And we have, we have two females here. We have the Queen of Cups, the Queen of Pentacles, and the Six of Pentacles. So, um, Aquarius, what is up here? So far, it shows here that you are focused here. You will be focused in your job, your career, your money, or are you trying to be focused on somebody here? Because we got the Queen of Cups and we got the Queen of Pentacles. One is nurturing and loving. And actually, this is wifey right here. And... The Queen of Cups, she has lots of love, lots of love to give. She has a lot of self-love. And balance is here. Hmm. Could this be a three-party situation here? It could be a three-party situation. Because there's balance here. You want, you're trying to find balance between... These two women, they could either be the same woman or they could be two different women. Okay, because one is wifey and the other one is not. This is wifey right here, the queen of pentacles. And this one is not. So it could be two different females that you're dealing with, all men. And you could be dealing with an earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. I'm seeing Virgo here with the queen of pentacles. And... You have water here, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio with the Queen of Cups. So, we have pentacles here. This pentacle. So, you could be dealing with an earth sign. So, let's find out what's going on. Let's see. Please give more information on the Six of Pentacles. Please give more information on the Six of Pentacles. Why is the Six of Pentacles here? Ooh, felt something in my face. Please give me more information on the Six of Pentacles. Why is the Six of Pentacles here? Please, ah, oh shit, way too many cards. Way too many cards. Let's keep 
that one there. Okay. If you get more information on the Six of Pentacles, why is the Six of Pentacles here? If you get more information on the Six of Pentacles, why is the Six of Pentacles here? If you get more information on the Six of Pentacles, if you get more information on the Six of Pentacles, way too many cards. If you get more information on the Six of Pentacles, Six of Pentacles, please. What is up with you guys? You guys are like all over the place. Am I? Mm, please give me more information. There we go. Hmm. So we got the two of cups, the emperor, and the devil. So you could be dealing with a Capricorn. And the emperor here, you could be dealing with the Aries. Now, there's a Mm. Here we go again. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Let me get this right here. Okay, so we have an emperor here. This emperor, he's a father figure. He's also a husband. And uh, he's fair. He runs a, his whole entire empire. People come to him because he makes wise decisions. And when he makes his wise decisions, everything tends to be fair. Right? Like the Six of Pentacles, fair, fairness. But for some reason, someone here is fearing commitment. Because we got the devil upright with a Two of Cups. Now you could be fearing commitment or someone here could be fearing commitment. Or actually, let me get one more card for this. Because I want to find out a little bit more with this devil here. Because this could easily be sexual attraction. Where you feel very passionate towards this person. But let me get one more card to verify that. Please give me more information on the Six of Pentacles. Oh baby. Please give me more information on the Six of Pentacles. Why is the Six of Pentacles here? Give me more information on the Six of Pentacles. Give me more information on the Six of Pentacles. Why the Six of Pentacles here? Give me more information on the Six of Pentacles. Why the Six of Pentacles here? Hmm. Please give me more information. Okay. You get more information on the Six of Pentacles. Why is the Six of Pentacles here? You get more information on the Six of Pentacles. What we got here? Hello. Okay, so this could have been a three-party situation because we got the Page of Cups. We got the Three of Swords. So someone, so so this could have been. Hold one second for me, Aquarius. One moment. I'm back. So, like I was saying, we got the Page of Cups and we got the Three of Swords. So, this could be a three party situation because we do have two females here. And this is not, a, it's not, it's not fear. Not more cards here. It's not fear. I'm seeing somebody feels very passionate and is upset with you either this could be you uh, Aquarius or this could be them with you and they want to make an offering here because look we got the two of cups the devil right in the middle and the page of cups this is someone being like obsessed with you 
because they want to come in and make this offering because they love you and they want things to be fair equal give and take and they want to make this obsessed because this person feels very passionate towards you they are you are like a big temptation for them you are a temptation for them either you aquarius or this is the other person but you are a big temptation for this person they're like really obsessed and they feel very passionate towards you and and then when you got this you got these three here let me show you this you got the emperor and the devil with the two of cups this is like sexual this is like sexual healing hey go ahead aquarius so you could be feeling very sexual towards somebody you could like this person could really turn your ass on this person turns you on when you see this person you be like damn that's one sexy ass motherfucker because there's a lot of sexual i feel a lot of is i mean it could be a three-party i mean situation because we got the three of swords so someone here is hurt someone got hurt here someone ended up getting hurt here but let's go on with the reading and look at the bottom of the deck we have the three of the six of pentacles again balance Balance is needed here. Let's find out about this Queen of Pentacles. Let's find out about Wifey. Please give me more information on it. Let me ask a question first. Slow down, Aquas. Please give me more information on this Queen of Pentacles. Why is this Queen of Pentacles here? Please give me more information on the Queen of Pentacles. Please give me more information on this Queen of Pentacles. Why is the Queen of Pentacles here? Give me more information on the Queen of Pentacles. Why is the Queen of Pentacles here? Please give me more information on this Queen of Pentacles. Why is this Queen of Pentacles here? Give me more information on this Queen of Pentacles. Well. You know what? You must be dealing with an earth sign. Because earth is like. Ruling, <laughs> it's like ruling your whole entire spread. So look what we have. The this is wifey. This is wifey right here. Look, OMG. Lord, Lordy, Lord, Lord, Lord. Look at this. We got couples here. We got the Empress now. New beginning, and remember, remember I told you, the emperor. So now we got a couple. There's a couple here. The emperor's a husband and the father, and there goes his wifey. Clarifying the queen of pentacles. Wifey. And we got the queen of pentacles, again, with the king of pentacles. Husband, wifey, and hubby right here clarifying clarifying the queen of pentacles and because there was two cards that came out x there was an extra card that came out you want to know what's extra card is bam four of wands four of wands and we got husband and wife across the board no matter how you look at it we got a husband and wife we got the empress emperor we got the king and queen of pentacles and we got the house right here we got the house and this person wants in okay this person um uh, this is wifey right here this is your wife right here i mean the queen of pentacles this is your wife either you guys could be in a relationship with this person or you guys could be living together in the same household and you guys want a new beginning you well no no. No. Because you want to make an offering. You want to make an offering to this person right here. Because you want a new beginning with this person. You want to expand. You want to grow with them. You want to become a couple. Because look. 
we got the empress right in the mid, right in between the king and queen of pentacles. So you want to be so this right here, you want a new beginning with this person. You want to expand with this person. You want to grow with this person. You want to you want to I mean you want love, you want happiness, you want all that is beautiful. You want it with this person. You want a wife. Because the Queen of Pentacles is also clarifying the Queen of Pentacles here. So this person, you love this person. And you want to make an offering to them. Because you feel because you feel very passionate towards them. You feel very passionate towards them. You are like, you got the hots for this person. Because this person turns you on. Big time. And you could, like I said, you could be dealing with an earth sign. And what did I say? The Queen of Pentacles represents what? A Virgo. Hello. A Virgo in the house. So tell me, what Aquarius out there got the hots for me? Because I know somebody does. Somebody got to have the hots. Got to have the hots for me. This is me just messing with you guys. But either way, and then you got the four of wands. So you guys could be a twin flame. This could be a twin flame situation here. This really could be a twin flame situation. Soulmate. Soulmate. This could be a soulmate situation or a twin flame so, uh, situation. Yeah, because we got husband and wife all the way. You are infatuated with this person. This person turns you on. I mean, they're the hot sauce to your scrambled eggs. You know, and you want to be with them. You want a new beginning with them. And like, But yes, somebody in the process did end up getting hurt. Because we have the three of swords here. Someone here got hurt. So let's get some more information for the Queen of Pentacles. I mean Queen of Cups. Please give me more information on this Queen of Cups. Please give me more information on this Queen of Cups. Please give me more information on the Queen of Cups. Please give me more information on the Queen of Cups. Please give me more information on this Queen of Cups. Give me more information on the Queen of Cups. We got the Five of Wands, so is there any fighting going on with a current person that you with now? Ooh! Aquarius. But you know how this came out? In reverse. Again. Another earth sign, and this is a Virgo right here. This is a single person that does not want to be single. And we got the five of wands, there's conflict here, and the two of pentacles. There's conflict here. So you got the queen. So you we have a uh, this person here, they're abundant. This person, they're abundant. They're abundant within their own rights. They're, they don't need no saving because they can save themselves. Really? Stop. Say you're making way too much noise. I'm sorry, guys. So this is a single person that's very abundant within their own right. They don't need nobody saving them because they're just fine and they're content being single or in a, within a relationship they're just fine but this person doesn't want to be single anymore they want to be in a relationship but what the but the thing is is that they're trying to juggle an idea if there's something that they're trying to juggle they could be juggling two people here because we got two we, we got three of swords and two females here and they try and juggle idea of who they should be with, who they're trying to choose, because this person doesn't want to be single, or this person just isn't single, and they have a wife, and the queen of the queen of cups is the other person. And we got the five of five of wands, so there's conflict here. There's conflict. So we got conflict here. Let's get more information on the Queen of Cups. Please get more information on the Queen of Cups. Why is the Queen of Cups here? Please get more information on the Queen of Cups. Why is the Queen of Cups here? Please get more information on the Queen of Cups. 
Please be announcing this on the King of Cups. Well, we got the star in reverse, so this person doesn't have faith. They don't have faith, and, and we got the ace of pentacles in reverse here. So this is a delay here on the new start, on the new beginning. You know what? The queen of cups and the queen of pentacles... That's the same woman. It's the same person. Yes, it is. Uh-huh. This is the same person right here. We got a mother here. That we, There's a mother here, a single mother. Single mother because we have the... We, 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 we also have this right here. This is, this is... I see this woman as a Virgo as well. She's like a pre-empress. She's like a pre-empress before the empress gets married. Because this is her being single. And this is an empress. And the empress is why she's married. But she, but this person right here, they're in reverse. Because they don't want to be single anymore. So, this is the same person. Because the person is... This person, she looks like she's, a, she's single. A single mom. Very strong and independent, nurturing, loving, caring, and has lots of love to give. Lots of love to give and has self-love for herself and also knows her worth and her value. She knows it. But there was conflict here. There was conflict here. Someone wasn't able to make a decision. There was, there was finding it hard to make a head over heart decision. There was conflict here, and someone doesn't want to be single. Someone didn't want to be single, so there was a delay on them becoming single, or not so much a delay, but I'm looking at it now as an opportunity was missed. Yeah, this person has no help. This person has no hope for this. For this to actually happen we got the ace of pentacles in reverse so it's like there's either a delay or was the opportunity missed already because when the opportunity when the ace of ace of pentacles is upright the opportunity is there for you it's there for the taking but when it's in reverse the opportunity is no longer there it's been missed so there was an opportunity here that was missed Yes, and this person doesn't have hope now. They don't have. They don't have no hope. They have no faith in this, and now this person doesn't want to be single. So they missed opportunity, and this was all because of conflict. It was all because of conflict because they couldn't make up their mind. Now this could have been in a conflict as well. This could have been in a conflict, and because they wasn't able to make up their mind. They wasn't able to make up some mind, so they ended up missing out on the opportunity. This is an opportunity that was missed. This is the same. These two queens are the same queens. They're not the diff. They're not nothing different. There's not two different females. They're the same queen. They're loving. They're caring. They're nurturing. They have a lot of self love for themselves and love to give, and lots of love to give. And they could be a single mom. You don't have to be a. You don't have to. Excuse me. What was that? Oh, you don't have to be a mom, but the Queen of Pentacles is a mom. Is a she is a mom, and um, she's very nurturing. She's loving, and she knows her worth. She knows her worth. She's caring, you know. And now this person wants. This person wanted a new beginning with this with this queen but it never took place because the opportunity was missed here because this person because either you Aquarius or the other person you guys feel very passionate towards this person and you could be dealing with an earth sign here because there's lots of pentacles here lots of pentacles here you feeling very passionate towards this person but the opportunity was already missed here so you're hurting, so both of you, so either you're hurting or 
the other person's hurting. You're hurting now because you want to come in. Actually, somebody wants to come in now and make an offering. Make an offering right now, but they really don't have faith. They really don't have faith that this is going to actually happen because they feel that the opportunity was already missed. They feel that the opportunity was already missed here because they didn't take action when they were supposed to. They didn't take action. But yet you feel very passionate towards this person, but it took you too long to take action. And you wanted, you wanted this with this person. You wanted to be husband and wife. Cause this is a couple right here. You wanted to be in the you wanted to be a couple with this person. You wanted this new beginning with this person. You wanted to grow and expand with this person. This person wanted it with you as well. They wanted to be a couple with you. But the opportunity was missed here. They wanted the four of wands with you. You wanted the four of wands, but it was missed. See, because you guys feel very passionate towards each other. There's passion here, there's love, there's, there's, uh, there's, there's lust, there's seduction. I mean, there's temptation here. It's like, it's, it's like, damn, you turn me on. It's like, man, you know, ooh, I got to have it. You know what I'm saying? So there was love here and the offering was here, but the offering was, it, it didn't come, it, it's not coming through because the opportunity was missed. The offering, you wanted to make this offering, but you took too long because it was missed. You missed the opportunity. Opportunity, I mean, well, I mean, you never know. You never know. But either way, right here with a with the star, because this is you, Aquarius. This is you. With this star being reversed, this is telling me that you really don't have faith that you could actually... What's the word I'm looking for? Uh, get this opportunity again. You, you really don't have faith that you'd be able to get this opportunity again with this person. Because you took too long and the opportunity was missed. So you really don't have faith in this. Let's, find, let's get some more information on this. Uh, I'm going to do the Queen of Pentacles. Actually, no. Let's get your outcome. I want to get your outcome first. Please give me an outcome for Aquarius. What is Aquarius' outcome? Please give me an outcome for Aquarius. What is Aquarius' outcome? You have the Hermit. I told you guys, you guys are dealing with freaking Virgos. You dealing with us. I need to leave you guys alone. Because you guys be getting me in trouble and shit. I need to leave you guys alone. Well, either way, you don't have to be dealing with Virgo. It could be any other side. You could be dealing with a fire sign. You could be dealing with a Capricorn. You could be dealing with a water sign. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. You could be dealing with a Capricorn, Taurus, or a Virgo. Or you could be dealing with... The Sagittarius, Leo, or Aries. Okay? Hold on a second, Aquas. I'll be right back. I'm back. I'm trying to cook dinner, that's why. Try to cook dinner and do these videos. Got to cook dinner for my daughter, you know. That's what we do. That's what the Queen of Pentacles does. We cook clean. We take care of the house. Take care of the kids. We do it all. And we work. Okay. So, we got the Hermit. Virgo. This is you going into isolation or somebody going to isolation. And now we got the eight of wands communication so it shows here that there's going to be communication taking place here with with a uh, virgo you or it could just if it's not a virgo it could be you just communicating with someone using search of what you use in search you went within isolate yourself in search of information and now you know what you want and now you're going to be communicating it Let's get some more, a little bit more information. 
Please give me more information on. Please give me Aquarius outcome. Please give me more information on Aquarius outcome. Please give me more information on Aquarius outcome. Please give me more information. See? You gotta communicate. Because you're not gonna give up. You don't have that much faith, but you know what? Because. Because. What I'm saying? Because you don't have faith. You don't have that much faith. You lost faith. You lost the opportunity. But now, you're going to communicate with this person. And with the nine of wands here, you're going to fight for this relationship. You're going to be very persistent for it. You're going to be very persistent about it. You're not going to take no for an answer. You're going to be very persistent towards this new this relationship. Because you do want to be with this person. Now you want to make the offering. And there's going to be communication here with the knight of, with the knight of uh, swords. There'll be communication. This could be fast communication. Either it's going to be traveling, you're going to be traveling to them, to another state, another city, another county, right up the street. Or it's going to be texting, email, uh, what's up. But it's going to be fast communication now. There will be communication, and either you or them, Aquarius, are not going to take no for an answer. You guys, wanna, you guys are going to be very persistent about it because you do want this, and you feel very passionate towards this person very passionate towards this person and you want to be with this person and you feel and you feel that you missed opportunity with this with this person you had the opportunity there but you missed it because you took too long so you missed the opportunity so you really don't have faith that this person will take you back you really don't have that much faith but you're still going to try. You're not going to give up. You're still going to try. You're going to communicate with a person. And you're not going to give up. You're not going to give up. You're going to be very persistent. Which is good. You're going to have You're gonna have to do that. So, I, I mean, hopefully it works out for you, Aquarius. Please give me a love advice reading for Aquarius. Let's get you a love advice reading here, Aquarius. Please give me a love advice reading for Aquarius. Power of angels. May your angels protect you, guide you, and keep you safe. There you go. Okay, Aquarius. So this is all I have for you. So good luck to whoever this is going to apply to. Good luck. Hopefully you're able to get the love of your life. And I will see you guys again next week for your weekly and monthlies okay bye aquarius